interesting and trendy. Yeah, you're right. Every day, but not only for something to good things. Like I'm just noticing now, with the Ndandagato Sarira, these past days I've been focused on other things. But right now, we're going to issue this other girl who's going to be abused, so and it's sad. Oh. And it's sad. Okay, guys, uh, this is Director Mouse, and I welcome you to Zim Cambus Confessions. Remember, this is episode 8. And a big shout out to the men behind the camera right now, Director Fidel. And a big shout out to all the presenters, Toby and the speaker, Patience Arif, Black Sushi, and Miss Porcupine. We, we just want to say shout out to you and Director Ivan Stupu. You're not forgotten, bro. He's one of the directors producing the show. Today with me, allow me to introduce uh, Miss Chris Bear. <laughs> But no, the bears and this with our the rugby berango. No, but it's her name. You know, uh, she she got that name just after realizing that she is Miss Chris Bear. So Miss Chris Bear, mm -hmm. welcome you to the show. Thank you. You uh, can say something to the viewers. Okay, I thank you, I director Mel, for welcoming me first. Uh, I just want to say to everyone uh, that is watching right now, my name is Chris Bear. But you know what? I just like to be called Miss Chris Bear. You know. Alright, tell me before we, we get into the discussion, where did the name Miss Chris Bay? Alright, why is why can be Okay, after discovering that I have the talent to talk right, I wanted something at least spicy, something in which uh, when the listeners hear about it, actually they can say wow. But then at first I say Miss Chris. So it was, it didn't sound good to me, so hmm. that's why I aim to say. Manzoga guys, maybe it was a, a test. You would have test this was good, but should tell her to get to my baby above for Luca. But, anyways, guys, like always, I say welcome. This is Zim Campus Confessions, and today we have an amazing topic that we're going to be discussing right now. And it, you know, guys, the issues that are now trending in Zimbabwe are different issues. I'm all good and Zimbabwe and the other <laughs> you know, but, but you know, it, it, it's a but you know, in that same vicinity, in that same sector environment, we are also seeing the abuse of the girl child, yeah. mm -hmm. which is something that is uh, happening on a daily basis. Yeah, it's something that happens every day. A two in four of the girls are being abused on a daily basis, mm -hmm. and you know, before we break this topic down. I want you to to tell me what you understand when we talk about a girl, girl, the girl child being abused in general. Okay, when talking about uh, child abuse in general, to get the girl child, it's something that happens. Like to know not to know that this is not good. And then Janga Singa fan longer she chitika. For example, the issue of rape and the issue of dating my places. It's something she go to. Um, my blessed said they should realize that no, this is not good. Actually, my now is my child. Okay, thank you very much. Viewers, you have heard it. And Matakla, she has tackled a sensitive issue. But our issue, my blessed. And we just want to dig deep right now into that issue. Miss Chris Bay, Matawa Mimi issue, my blessed. Okay, and uh, throughout my researches, I have uh, come to realize that mostly the girl child in universities do are going to face these challenges. Now, how best can we try to explain why it is so good that my girl child are in universities do are going to face these challenges? Why not those in communities? Why are we not having my issues and my blessers in, in the community, but we are having them at large in universities? Why is it so? I think as it is happening at large in my universities, mm -hmm. like here at the University of Zimbabwe, because you know what, Director Mel, Panruku Yaku University, Panruku Yaku University from a poor background, and then you know, Shukabra mm -hmm. University, and you know, 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 the day is Rako Kufusa with uh, let me go out there and the struggle, Chango, Chibi, and the Sashina Constabulous, and the thing that I just 
Wow, you know what viewers, as you are listening, Marquita Taco, my issues are sensitive at the same time, bringing out the educative part about this discussion. And it is a sensitive issue, but a memory. The reason why so, remember, we are now tackling the question why the girl child is being abused. But before we do that, uh, you know, we're just going to take a short break. Uh, stay tuned with us. Remember, this is Zim Campus Confessions, episode 8. Remember, viewers, we were discussing and we were now venturing into understanding why the girl child is being affected at large when it comes to her being abused. And remember, we were now in segment number two and my guest today, I have Miss Chris Bear with me. So stay tuned. We are now entering into segment number two. So we are back indeed, Tangatishi discuss, and what I've loved uh, so far about this discussion is Matawara is a sensitive issue, Miss Crispe. One of the reasons why we are facing these issues mostly in universities mm -hmm. is in, and, and not in the communities is because our backgrounds are Kassiana, and most of the students are from a background which is not a financially stable background. So at the moment now they enter into the universities and they now start to experience pressure. And you have talked about pressure. So I want to ask you a question. Right now, there is a girl child who is watching this and following this right now. What's your advice to her? Since you're saying, do not let your background determine whether you're going to get a blessing or not. Okay. What's your word of advice? Okay, so my word of advice, the girl that is watching us right now, is that actually first appreciate where you come from when you come uh into this university you know but in any i belong to the poor family and actually i know your vision with me now have a university and i need to attain my degree maybe i want to be a doctor i want to be a lawyer just to focus on that just to so i need this and me and dinner it's something else just to focus on that and actually you will realize that at the end of the day four years or five years that you are going to spend a visual and you know what? So appreciate where you come from. Right, Mazinzira. You know, you have been listening and I've been following. She has been saying, know your background. You might be coming from a background that is not financially stable, but the moment that you enter into the environment, which is the university, I don't know, maybe you might be entering into the university of cut, into the uh, uh, heat uh, environment, into the uh, University of Zimbabwe environment, into Buse environment, Zegu, I don't know, the university that you might be entering into. But understand this, your background doesn't have to determine if you're getting a blessing. So this is what she say and uh what i would want to say my, my word of advice as well is that whenever you have a background that is like this understand we have things that would make that will sustain you as a student engage initiate into businesses you know i love it when a students come here as a girl child or as a boy child they end up selling sweets they end up selling you know stockings they end up uh, selling uh, clothing on, on, online you know advertising even books that's the proper way to do it. You don't have to fight your lack of money by in by having a blesser by your side. Are you understanding? Also, our directors, I appreciate what is happening here at the University of Zimbabwe. See what is happening here at the University of Zimbabwe. What was introduced to the work that program? Actually, it is helping everyone. Be it a girl child. You know what? Instead of uh, engaging in blessers, I can one to marry the you can actually work here at the University of Zimbabwe and find your own campus in the agro industry or what. Then actually your feet can be covered rather than going out there and visit the place. Thank you, Miss Crisbe. Mm -hmm. In Matore, a very good point when it comes to my issues at later say work study. Mm -hmm. The University of Zimbabwe indeed initiated a work study program. Mm -hmm. But to other students out there who do not have this work study, my universities out. Mm -hmm. You know, what you can simply do is this. Remember, I mean, I feel like as students these days, it's, you know, 
let's come from get a, a bit from a biblical perspective the bible says my people perish not because they lack anything other than knowledge and i feel like this is happening again because students do perish now because they lack knowledge our churches we have scholarships out there people, the government is giving scholarship to students who are vulnerable ngos are giving scholarships to students who are vulnerable we have even people in the community the prominent figures who are giving scholarships to students who are vulnerable but the problem is that students now do not have this information you get it so when you you are prone uh, to to such uh, disasters that are happening now in such as blessers with one of the very and all that you then end up forgetting what in the community we have these things that are happening like the giving out of scholarships and all that so for a student if you want you know that you are vulnerable and you are failing to pay your school fees kokumbunza mna riba side i'm facing this talk to your friend close friend i'm facing this how best can i solve it talk to your lecturer ma'am i'm facing this what's the advice what's the way forward you get it mm-hmm. like i'm saying kuti it's now because uh, students were with a lack of knowledge they they are facing this challenge kuti avana knowledge kuti how best can i deal with this but if a student are going to the lecture i think anukwansa ubatsi what's your take on this i think uh, that's right so no no it's the right way me rather it's better to talk to your lecture or sometimes to your best friend but like but you always also remember with the that you should be shamari not the kind of friend that you have to talk to because sometimes you channel with the moon and with the jama blessings you know and then i will cover the wrong advice so first you need to consider with is this a, a the right friend to tell or no and that was we are not supposed to do it wrong so first you need to consider also that Okay so you've heard it for yourself you know when you are doing this when you're interacting with them now know the type of person that you are interacting with for you wouldn't want you to be disturbed or to enter into the same environment that you are running away from are you getting this so be wise in your doing be wise in your thinking and be wise in your acting and with that viewers we'll leave you to the third segment that is coming stay tuned Guys, magambo nzwere ka song ka Enzo Aisha okay unzanze vakamhanya makarima. You know that song paints everything out, you know. Stay stick to your moral values. The good moral values that you have, stick to them. They will help you. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, I don't know but you must be having a cup of coffee by your side cuz kimchando ukupisa ndiri but you could jambo chipisa mchando emoma remember we we'll welcome you to the third segment tangati chita discuss we were pondering on issues affecting the girl child be it abuse be it rape cases be it depression be it stress be it pressure you know pressure doesn't have to affect the girl child so that's what we are discussing and welcome to the third episode uh i will i'll introduce my guest viewers we are back and as i've promised allow me to introduce the guest once again you know i think this is for the third time ndinge ndikufarisa zvitere kuti miss chris bay guys <laughs> okay so guys we were still talking and right about now we want to discuss the issue concerning pressure miss chris bay what's your take for pressure are these girls not getting the pressure from social media number one are they not getting the pressure from their very own close friends that they call friends okay at uh, first day, i would say that girls are getting a pressure from social media you know with the my celebrities out there they are posting nice clothes to teach each other my out and you as a girl should actually find a pressure with us again that i start why can't you listen to my mb and when i get to go in a celebrity then actually now go to the D1 and you but for you one on your phone to get up a big up and the very problem in the room of places and also for my close friends you can actually talk about your imagine of the pictures you know uh Margot Tamba is my friend who's gonna show my yako I work my lectures especially maybe be a raise or none raise I work my lectures and in my energy energy assembles are good because you're up to standard and you but if I'm about to put your phone out to ya up and that's that everything shows up a peer pressure because remember the definition 
in a peer pressured that you want to fit in in a certain group of people, not no, many now that would have a future in a group of director, not so. Do it as say about in the future in so far now that would have a future in the group, either which in a group of scam now would have not a gum of this of Jinduani Marion, the Quanta for Afuda, Jinozavarku and now. You have heard it, viewers. This is a very sensitive issue. So, what she's just saying is simply this, guys. Do not let social media be the provocative weapon to cause such pressure. I, I understand this. The moment you allow social media to become the distraction, indeed, it will become the distraction you have been wishing for. Because social media, as you never go to Wagufan or Gone Embeo, can I also now? And that's what you are saying. Time will come when you have such. I taste it in the very same things, right? I'm very many. And you know what? I'm a whole monomaka, not a letter and marry each one who actually taste it as good as in the fan and a doctor on a director. No, if my name be another way, another actually the cover natural corner of this. And always remember that your time will come one day. Opportunities they don't come as at the same time. So remember, within one day, it is going to be your time. I thank you, viewers, for staying tuned. I remember this is Zim Kamba's Confessions, episode eight. You know, we were discussing, and we finally concluded that the reason why the girl child is being affected mostly is number one because of pressure. Number two is because of the association that they surround themselves with. Number three is because they judge themselves according to their background. It might be a background that is not financially stable. So we were saying, do not let be that be a factor that will then conclude to say, in the end, I would have blessed her because a background young we are Are you understanding this? So we were encouraging the girl child out there that stay focused, at least to introduce something new in your own environment. Why not venture into a business? Why not just pray? Why not leave it uh, to the time to come where you have that which you do not have? And it, so I uh, thank you, Miss Chris Bear, for being with us today as our guest. And this was your host, Director Mouse. And I just want to give a shout out. And this shout out, first of all, guys, I want to give a shout out to Oyo Sport. Remember, Oyo Sport has been sponsoring us with t shirts. And in the coming episodes we're going to be wearing these t-shirts Adidiga, which is a big shout out to them and also shout out to director fidel the man behind the camera right now the man producing and uh you know editing all the videos that are coming out these days you know and shout out to director Ivan stupu shout out to patient sarif shout out to black sushi and miss porcupine these are the guys that are in the production are psycho and they lead to the you know post-production of Zim Campus Confessions. So a shout out and above all, use it cafe. Don't forget, go put on a cafe, buy a beggar, buy a drink, buy my hair. And right now we have my tower beggars. Why boy is here to a tower beggar? You know, you know, use it cafe. They sponsor us with this is one of the it's because of them. And